Hello friends, in today's video we will learn how to calculate our age using the python code. So first of all we have to import date time then calculate the current date and time and then we have to calculate the current year and the current month. So this is the syntax to read the current month year. Let's check what happened if we print this variables. When we run this code, the first one is now. So now indicate this part. So it display the date, time. And the year is only reading the year and the month. So for this project, we don't need this print function. So we'll just remove this. Now we need to ask the user about the birth year and the birth month. So the values we are getting the birth year and the birth month are in the form of integer. But the year and the month, the current year and the current month calculated over here are in the string. So we need to convert the string value to integer just to compare the birth year and the birth month. So here we have to check whether the birth year entered by the user is smaller than the current year or not. If it is, then only it will continue. So after that, it will check that the birth month is smaller than the month or not. Okay. And here we have used the x to calculate the edge. So the year minus both year will give the edge and the y the how much month and use the print to display your edge is x and the y is and this much month. But in this what happened it's not compulsory that the both month is always smaller than the current month. So there is another else conditions. That if the birth month is greater than the month, it will be like, so right now it's June, so the person have the birth month 12, then we have to do the, this else condition. So in else, we are calculating the age by the current year minus the birth year and subtracted by 1 because the birth day haven't arrived this, this year. And to calculate the month we have to do both month because the both month is greater than the current one so we subtract it and the whole will subtract the 12 to get the exact month so let's run the code and see enter the birth here so let's take 2000 and take here 5 so say your age is 21 year and one month. So if I want to put year also, we can use year. So let's run it again. Let's take 2003. Four. 18 years and 2 months. So now if we take something 2004 and enter the birth month. So let's take 12, so it's like 16 year and the 6 month. Here. Now, if now we have given the condition that if the birth year is smaller than the current year, but if the user by mistake feed the birth year is greater than the current year. Then it come to the else part and print. So it will print check your both year once again. So let's run this code. So the both year let's take 2022. Check your both year once again because it's not possible to calculate age 
We know both years is greater than the current year. This is the whole code. Hope you will enjoy this and learn something new. Just subscribe my channel for more updates.